Hey guys, it's Don Robertin here, episode 5 of our Let's Play Adventures in Cobblewood. Uh, now, I've just arrived back from the train station. Um, I've been to uh, been to the vault where we uh, carried over some materials um, and claimed what was mine, uh, basically. Um, I come back and I've noticed this change here. And there's a blue sheep there. So, I think somebody's paid me a visit. Let's have a look. Hello, derby sheep. Um, this looks the same. I think you need these, Eds. Interesting. Not quite sure what I'm going to do with that, Eds, but... Uh, thanks all the same. Uh... <laughs> Let's take a look in here. Anything different? No. Uh, see, that we're nearly done. Um, as you saw in the last episode, I uh, I think I get to finish all of it. But uh, that's a oh god, what is this? What on earth? <laughs> so, um, it seems that somebody likes lapis as much as I do. Um, this is going to take a while to uh, redo. Some signs here. Hey, we heard you like lapis, so we gave you some. Pico and Bob. Um, well, thanks, but you could have left it in a chest or something, no? Well, tell you what, what I'm going to do now is, uh, this is going to take a while, so I'm going to cut here and uh, dismantle all the lapis. Alrighty, and we're back. Uh, so I've cleaned up all the lapis. As you can see, look how much lapis we got. Quite a fair bit. Um, not to worry, as we can start using that lapis in some of our creations. Now, let's have a look and see what it looks like. Want me to be this? It's interesting. Interesting. Um, we put a bit of lapis there basically because uh, look down towards the train station. We're going to use a lot of lapis. Um, I think that's quite nice. We still want the kind of corner edge, so I don't really want to do a square pillar out of it or anything like that. Uh, what else do we need? Uh, we need to go chop down some wood. For that, I shall create an axe. Uh, we could also harvest that wheat, but I'll do that uh, off camera because, let's face it, who wants to watch somebody harvest wheat? So, I hope you guys all enjoyed episodes uh, 3 and 4, uh, they came up pretty pretty close to each other, uh, and I realised that this one, in relation to the others, is uh, a little bit behind schedule, but uh, yeah, I mean, I hope you enjoyed it, I'm still working on the resolution, still, I know I said in episode 2 that I had it... Uh, <laughs> I had it fixed, but uh, obviously, as you can see, it, it kind of got a little bit better, but didn't really, uh, you know, wasn't really that better. Um, so let's go chop down some wood. So this episode, is, I'm recording it uh, quite a, a little time after uh, episode four, um, mainly because I haven't had a chance to log in. 
uh, to the game for for a little while. Um, I've just been experiencing like uh, other games and uh, other tasks and things like that. Um, got a a blue sheep. Um, I'm also trying to think of uh, little pranks I can do to to get back at uh, Farmer Bob for the uh, the lapis. So. We'll have to see if we can come up with something that's uh, a little bit creative, um, but also not uh, not destructive. We don't want to be, uh, you know, destroying his things or anything. So we shall see what we come up with. Um, let's just harvest some wood. We'll just do this front row for now. Uh, we leave it to um, shed its leaves and whatnot. And done. Looking good. Alrighty. So, what are we going to do today? I hear you ask. Well. There's lots of things that we can do today, and um, one of them involves putting a fence gate on the paddock, because it's about time that I put one there anyway, so. Uh, right, if I remember correctly, it's something like this. Ta-da! Fence gate. Miraculous, really. Let's go. Um, beautifully done. So now we can get in and out without uh, too much trouble. There's a spider on the other end there. Um, it's a bit dark over here. Can put, put a torch there. Aha! Uh -huh. he's, he's, he's come in! How did he get in? I swear spiders can like climb. Oh! I missed some lapis. Okay. Needs more lapis. We need lots of lapis. It's my, uh, my lapis song. It's not very good, uh, but it would probably win the Eurovision or something. I mean, Eurovision. Now, I, I can't understand how that's still going, but I guess it's not meant for the likes of me. Uh, okay, so what are we going to do? We're going to need some wooden planks because we need to fix up some things. Fix up some things. Things, things, things. Do, do, do. Somewhere over here, there it is. That wasn't what I wanted. Curse of the sideways log. I was really excited that they implemented sideways logs, and now that they're here, they're causing me nothing but issues. Um, I need to go and harvest some, some reeds. So I shall do that. There we go. And we'll put another one there. Just to be a little bit symmetrical. And I'll have something there. So let's go harvest some reeds with my trusty spider eye. Uh, I'm not quite sure that a spider eye is the ideal uh, tool to harvest reeds, but uh, it'll do. It'll do. Oh, oh, it's very dark here. Better put some lights, some torches. How has nothing spawned here? That was an oversight when I created this beach. 
Um, okay. 35 sugar cane. Um, basically, it is kind of like a harbor. Um, you know, but for now, it's... I mean, because there's, there's not kind of like... Because uh, i got a rail system as a way in uh, to the place. Uh, I'm not really too phased um, as to like creating a, a wooden uh, harbour type thing here. I will probably leave that entryway there just, just in case I kind of want a harbour entrance. Uh, but for now, it, it, it'll do. Um, I'll put some reeds here. Uh, these are purely decorational. I mean, if I want to create some books uh, later on, then obviously I've got the option to. Um, so the other bit we've got sand. I'm pu putting it purely on sand because one, it grows faster, and two, it kind of looks better in my opinion. Um, so we just have it Oh, well, that doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Uh, we just have it lining the uh, the lake area, so the basically kind of I don't know. I think it would look nice. Have a little bit of a bit of lining or so. Um, we'll see how it looks. If it looks terrible, then we can obviously go back and change it. Um, hello. Ah, oh, skills. Oops. Um, Alright, so we'll get some dirt. We'll fill in the uh, creeper face because as much as I like creepers, it's uh, it's not a feature I kind of want. <laughs> uh, no offense. Mr. Bob, but uh, I'm stealing all your lapis and it's gonna stay in my inventory. I'll just fill that in there. Looks really nice. There. And now it's a dirt creeper face, but grass will grow. Uh, that's. Ah, that was so much easier to, uh, add some eggs. Um, I'm getting sidetracked by the, uh, the zombie noises. Nothing. Ah, you thought you could escape, but no. Um, at some point, I really do need to remember to get a pig. <laughs> it's gonna be one of those things. Uh, so let's go back down here. Um, actually, while I remember, I'll make some fence posts. Uh, and that there. And then we're left with two. That's fine. Seven fences. There we go. That looks alright. I think. Let's have a look. Yeah, that'll do. Um, we'll create some more. There, there. That will do quite nicely. Um, I, I mean, I kind of like having. Damn it! Too short. Okay. Um. 
I don't even have sticks. Uh, I kind of like the kind of fence post thing. Um, but also that option to kind of... They have a little bit of room here. I think it looks alright. Um, oh yeah, we need to finish the roof. That's okay. Um, we can do... Like this. And get the scaffolding going. And we can hit a uh, roof bit there. Good job. Okay, now we can go up. So we can do it like this. Okay. And we got that there. Uh, uh, there. And there. And that there. Like so. Now, put torch there. Torch there. Uh, torch there, so nothing can spawn in it. Now, then we go a bit. Put that there. Now, we can put a torch up here. Oh, I can't put it there because it's stairs. Okay, not to worry. We can maybe get like a redstone lamp or something. Uh, I mean, these torches are kind of only temporary. Um, the ones on the roof are permanent, but uh, inside here, I will most likely um, do some form of like redstone lamp or something. And this will look quite nice. It's kind of accentuate it a bit um so down we go here that's fine uh we need to replace that at some point uh the blue sheep has moved <laughs> okay so this probably won't be enough uh with the logs but now what am i gonna do here i'm sick it maybe sideways logs I could just do this. Kind of gives it a little bit of pattern. Or I can do it kind of like this. So every corner is like this sort of thing. Um, then it goes along. That looks a little bit better actually, doesn't it? Okay, we'll do it that way. I mean, this way looks fine, but uh, it's a little bit, I don't know, a bit, bit too much, maybe. We'll just turn that out there. Uh, lots of zombies underneath me, which slightly worries me. Mainly because I thought I, I lit up that place quite well. Evidently not. Okay, so we need to go farming for some more wood at some point. Um, zombie using the door. Uh, I think you need these. Oh yeah, that was the TNT and the axe there. So, that's... The sheep still there. Um, now comes the fun bit. I'm trying to find out exactly how I want to do this. Now, what I might do is just continue on the half slab uh, pathway and just kind of link it up here to the train station bit. Um, and I've got a Replace this with cobble because I don't like the, uh, the dirt bits. We'll do that now. While I remember. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm, I'm leaving that, uh, that lapis there. So. 
there and put the torch back there um, it's like everybody everybody hates lapis and I don't know why but anyway let's boogie on down to the train station and I'll show you the kind of idea I've got um, leaving the lapis like that there as well and I've got a Try and figure out the best uh, suspension bridge uh, kind of idea for this place. Um, let's go. I mean, I'm not going to do much radical change here. Just leave it kind of open um, where it comes into here. And you'll see the kind of idea that I've got. Um, hopefully, I don't get any kind of chunk errors or anything like that. Um, let's see. Down we go. Into the confusing. Oh, I forgot that Bob broke the track. Okay. Uh, we've had a few problems um, here. And obviously, everybody is decorating their tunnel. Uh, you can see here, they decorated it quite nicely with some brick. Uh, obviously, everybody's tunnel is now actually better than mine. <laughs> As you can see, I, I'm going for a kind of lapis kind of thing. Uh, this is Bob's. Uh, looks very nice. Looks like you go into a, a place of learning, like a university. Ed's is just audacious. I mean, come on. Look how much gold he's got. Like these are like nine gold, uh, nine gold bars for each block, right? And then he's put gold in the floor. I mean, it's like. He must have something regal going on down there, something royal. Um, this, I haven't been down here before. Um, but it looks quite nice, with a little sandstone finish. Um, this, oh, yeah, that's wool. Okay, so I don't know what's going on down there. Uh, down there, I absolutely no idea Ooh, we can have a quick peek at the redstone oh it looks so beautiful uh, Bob does tell me that uh, this is probably not the cleanest design uh, for redstone but uh, we'll put some torches in here for sure for sure Bob creepers will explode your stuff gotta get this Lit up like a Christmas tree. Um, I think some of this is kind of like already hollowed out caves. Ooh, a mine shaft. Wow. Okay, I don't really, really want to explore the mine shaft because it's already been pilfered. Um, okay. Oop. That goes down to some slimes. Um, we'll figure out later where that goes. Uh, what we're gonna do? I mean, the Wazret just has to have the most elaborate um, design. I mean, like a little W there with lava. Um, he's often called Lava Man. Um, some glowstone there. Um. Lights, damn it. Um, I might tell Bob to kind of put some redstone lamp there or something. Um, so I started this off camera. Uh, so let's. Oh. Uh, okay. Bob warned me about this. Uh, <laughs> so, what you're going to see now. Is a bunch of redstone and repeaters dropped down on my head. Um, he left me a little place where I can go to get back up there and fix it. So it's not a huge issue. Um, what we're going to do though is put some torches. Um, on the floor, because obviously I'm gonna. Oh, shit, better. 
I don't know if there's redstone on that. Okay, so put lapis there. Bollocks. Now I'm stuck. I think. No. Okay. Uh, oh, there's Zara. We'll give him a, a friendly how do you do. Is there redstone on there? No. Okay, I can safely destroy that block. Or can I? Was that maybe cancelling a signal? I think it was. Let's put it back. Shit, how do I put it back? That was retarded. Sorry. Um, okay. Oh, look, everyone's coming online now. Obviously, uh, obviously heard I was recording. Um, okay, if it breaks, I know that there's something that I have to do there. Um, Mr. Bobby. <laughs> um, okay, so... What we shall do is put lapis there. And I shall put it to good use. Um, move the stone axe. Get the redstone there. Let's pick this up before it despawns or something like that. Um, put that there. Um, after this, though, there shouldn't be any issues, um, really. What I will do, though, is remove that torch and put it there. Um, that I'm not sure on. Um, okay, well, there you go. Ed's clarified it. Um, so, we got adstone like that, and obviously these uh, repeaters need to be linked, but now I'm missing some redstone. So have I done something wrong? <laughs> um, go there. Maybe one drop that I didn't pick up. Oh, it's a repeater. So I've definitely done the layout wrong. Um, maybe the repeater go here. Like that. And then like that. Okay, seeing as we're kind of done destroying the redstone, <laughs> let's just quickly test that. Um, should, in theory, work. Oh, I need to block the signal. I forgot. Okay, um, I need to cut the link. Do that by placing a block there and there. That works, right? No? Um. Okay. They're still getting power somehow. 
let's put on our redstone hat. Um, I need to figure out. That did nothing really. Um, surely it had to do something. Just take a quick. Still getting power from somewhere. Where is it getting power from? It's not going as far as the repeater. So. Originally, I had decided to. Uh, do this whole lapis thing, but uh, let's take a look at this redstone. Where is it getting power from? Let's, let's figure this out. It's getting conducted from somewhere. So this is this is my thing. Then it gets inverted there. So it comes there. So how is that getting powered? Because I I've cut the signal, but it's still getting power from something. Okay, so, this episode is running a little long, so what I shall do is close it off here. Uh, we'll just finish off this lapis there. Um, I might just leave it at that kind of thing and then have the rest of it just on the floor. Um, I might just do the whole thing, screw it, to be honest. <laughs> whole uh, tunnel of lapis, why not? Um, so I'm going to leave it at there. Uh, thank you very much for watching again, guys. Uh, it's much appreciated. Um, and I hope you continue to enjoy this stuff. So it's farewell from me. And the, just a quick note to say, the cats at the train station have disappeared. Au revoir.